On today's Spicy Kiss Review, the third of four limited time Takis flavors to try for science. I love the name on this one, folks. It's Takis Lava. So when I think lava, I think of the Big Island and all of the lava flow fissures, things that's going on on there right now. And unfortunately, a whole bunch of homes have gotten destroyed there. So I'm thinking, you know, something nuclear spicy, something temperature hot. But then you look at the ingredient list, or at least the description here, and it says cheese and chipotle. So I have absolutely no idea how they came up with this name or why they figured that would be intimidating to anybody. Is it because of the smokiness of the chipotle? Is it because the cheese kind of looks like it's bright and, and gonna intimidate somebody? I have absolutely no idea. But let's give this a smell here. And it pretty much smells like barbecue Takis. Just like a barbecue smell. Get the smokiness in there from the chipotle peppers. And it just looks like a barbecue chip too. First things first, I love the barbecue flavor on this. I love the smokiness from the chipotle. I'm really just not sure where the cheese is in all of this. There's a cheese in here? I didn't really catch that. So the thing with the regular Takis flavors is that you get at least an idea of how spicy that particular chip is. Here there's no gauge, there's no way to really tell from the bag, there's no label or whatnot that shows you how spicy it is. And I'm just gonna tell you straight up, there's really no heat whatsoever on this unless you count the back end, which is what a .25, if, and that's even being generous on that one. But otherwise, I don't even know why they came up with this name. Love the barbecue flavor though. I'll give this a high four out of five just because of the flavor. But hey folks, it's Taki's Lava. Let's at least amp up the spice level on this. Got some Reaper Sriracha sauce here. Mad Dog 357 Reaper Sriracha sauce. Why not have the Guinness World Record holder, right? As of right now anyway, world's spiciest pepper. Coat this a little nicely and at least it's so narrow you can at least get this, uh, fit this in the bottle. Boy, those Reapers hitting here, man. Wow. You might have also seen this on a Cult Moo episode somewhere. Go check out their channel as well, link in the description. So folks, would you try Taki's Lava for science? Let me know down in the comments. That's all for the Spicy Kiss review, guys. Embrace that pain, and I'll see you in the next video.